All right. Uh, good morning. This is Luke Thomas, QuakePrediction.com here at the Earthquake Channel. It is 8.50 in the morning on Wednesday, October 28th. And we're going to give you an update on the situation in California, the earthquake risk. We've been talking about a strong earthquake in California since the beginning of this month, around October 1st. You can see that in the videos online uh, over at YouTube. And um, here's the current situation. Uh, well, first of all, let's do a little bit of review. Back on the 18th, we had a strong peak, and um, the signal was like a 50, I believe, and we were a 50... Uh, signal was uh, back on uh, August 24th of 2014, which produced a 6.0 earthquake in Napa, California at that time. Uh, and uh, so we have that strong signal back on the 18th, and that produced, uh, it didn't release the energy, by the way, and it produced a 3.5 down near Barstow and Ludlow, a 3.5 and 3.2 in Southern California. 3.4 in Northwest California. And then on the 19th, it produced a 3.8 and a 3.4 Northwest of San Francisco Bay. And then we had a smaller peak on the 26th. You can see that over on the graph at quakeprediction.com. We had a 3.5 in Northern San Francisco, by, uh, San Francisco Bay in Angwin, Angwin, uh, California. Now, uh, go to quakeprediction.com and click on the link to uh, Los Angeles and you'll see the current peak makes the peak on the 18th look much smaller because uh, the risk is much higher coming up on the 29th into the 30th of this month, October 29th and 30th, which is during the next uh, 36 to 48 hours. And the risk units has jumped from 50, which is equivalent to a 6.0, to 60, which is equivalent to a 6.5 to 7.0. So uh, here's our warning. The risk is very high across all of California, and a 5.0 earthquake or larger is, uh, is likely across California, and possible across all of California, including the San Francisco Bay. Um, the highest risk is coming out of uh, the units or of, of risk is coming out of Los Angeles, um, and the second highest is out down near the Salton Sea. But anywhere in California during the next uh, 36 to 48 hours, you can get a 6.0 to 7.0 earthquake. Um, but our warning is for a 6.5 to 7.0 earthquake in California, most likely northwest of uh, Los Angeles. And uh, also near the Salton Sea. So 6.5 to 7.0. And this is because the energy was not released that should have been released when the unit was, uh, the risk unit was at 50, but it didn't release. So that's why the risk level has jumped to 60 now. And uh, so that we're looking for a 6.5 to 7.0 earthquake within the next uh, 36 to 48 hours in California, most likely. Uh, northwest of Los Angeles or near the Salton Sea, but uh, San Francisco is not out of the woods, so everybody, please stay tuned and uh, please warn your friends and family that uh, the next 36 to 48 hours will produce a strong, strong earthquake, uh, 6.5 to 7.0 earthquake in California, most likely northwest of Los Angeles. And uh, please stay tuned for updates. And uh, please look at uh, quakeprediction.com for the, uh, the risk graphs over there. We'll be updating other cities. We have uh, El Centro, Los Angeles, and San Francisco updated currently. And we'll be uh, updating uh, Bakersfield, Colinga, Eureka, Reno, Ridgecrest, and San Diego, and Santa Maria uh, today within the next couple hours. So thank you so much. And be prepared for a 6.5 to 7.0 earthquake within the next 60 within the next uh, 36 to 48 hours. Thank you so much.